I guess I am. Table seven. Yeah, you, can, you have to hold it kind of right. That's supposed to be right there. Oh, okay. Uh, we talked about kind of uh, learning, personalized learning from the standpoint of uh, demand driven in a sense by the business community and uh, who would need it. It actually would start with the uh, uh, developmental model and would incorporate, of course, the standards for the Common Core or whatever everybody is talking the, that day and the Kerr Cluster standards and specific standards for industries like the NIM standards for manufacturing. It would really need to be a roadmap that was, would enable the learner, uh, and that would be the lifelong learner, to determine where they are at accomplishing the competencies needed to progress to the next step. It would uh, um, show them stopping off points where they could earn a liver, living for adult learners because few learners can afford to go through four years of college or, or even the master's degree that really seems to be necessary nowadays without earning a living. So uh, it would align to standards, create a pathway, preferably a visual pathway, so that people could really see colored in on that road map where they are, where the next stopping off part point would be, and uh, what they've mastered so that they can have a feeling of success. Is there anything else? I think we're good.